Okay, this is number 14 off the Cutta Inscribed Angles worksheet. I'll put a link to the worksheet below the video, um, and it also has solutions. This is a great worksheet to practice your circle skills in geometry. Okay, so here we see, oh, one more thing. We were trying to find the measure of arc angle FGH. So we would like to know the arc angle from here all the way around the circle to here. Okay. A good place to start on almost all of these when you have a variable, like x. I would like to start by solving for x. So the way I'd like to do that is I'd like to see that this is a quadrilateral. This is a four-sided shape inscribed in a circle. Remember that when a shape is inscribed in a circle, all of its points, all of its vertices, must touch the circle. So here we have a quadrilateral inscribed in a circle. And remember that if we have a quadrilateral inscribed in a circle, then the opposite angles are supplementary which means they add to 180. So this plus this must be 180. So let's try it. So we'll say 21x minus two, which remember that's just that angle, plus this angle, which is 38x plus five, should equal 180. All right, so now it's just algebra time. So 21 plus 38 is 59x. Five minus two is three equals 180. I'll subtract 3 from both sides. So 59x equals 177. I'll divide both sides by 59. And I believe I get, we'll do 177 divided by 3. I get 59. Oops, excuse me, I did that backwards. We'll do 177 divided by 59. We get x equals 3. Okay, so we have x. So we're making good progress. Now notice that the arc angle here is twice the inscribed angle here. Because we know that arc angles that correspond to inscribed angles, for that case, the arc angle is always twice the inscribed angle. All right, so we can find this angle by just plugging x in. So let's try it. I'll say the measure of angle A equals 38x plus five. So I'll say 38, and we know x is just three plus five. So that equals, calculator time, 38 times 3 plus 5 is 119. Okay, 119 degrees. And now we know that our arc angle, because it corresponds to this inscribed angle, should just be this times 2, which is 238 degrees. All right, there you go. Uh, if you have a question about a different problem on the worksheet, feel free to leave a comment or send me an email. Thanks.